Uh, so my audience has been clipping stuff more often, and I think within a couple of days, I'm probably just going to grab all of them thus far, compile them into a You're video. You're going to make a clip, a clip component? Comp yeah, wow. might as well. Oh, words. Highlight can reel. You, can you say what I wanted to say? You wanted a highlight reel. Or a click or a clip compilation. Say. Thank you. A comp clipilation. <laughs> you know, we haven't seen, um... We haven't seen the hexagons in a while. That's good. I don't want to see them every mission. What the Even, fuck? What the hell was that? I, our the wing divers have, the, have horrendously have, annoying weapons. Yeah, our teammates have your bounce shot that you loved. Back when you were the one holding it. Uh... Theirs is like a much more annoying version of it. Mine is not that bouncy, unless I'm in caves. No, yeah, that was that was a thing we had to live through. We remember. Yeah, that's good. I didn't like. I don't like it. I don't like living through it. Oh, well, I guess <laughs> I'm falling down this hole. Oh. I used to do highlight reels for sad games back in the day, back when we were doing like one or two videos a day. But once you're doing more, it's like there's a nightmare archive to clip through when you're yeah. thinking of making that stuff. But, like, if my audience does it for me at the moment that it happens, it works. I also got better at sound. I got better at uh, sound editing. And oh, here come the dragons. Applying, oh, here come the dragons. I got better at, like, applying decent post effects to your, the audio to make it sound better, which led to it, make it being way harder to find uh, highlight moments because the, uh, I basically would look for them by looking for the parts where the audio got really loud. <laughs> it's like, something happened there. <laughs> That's going to be a highlight moment. Wow, uh, that is lazy. But once I was actually, <laughs> once I actually had uh, effects on all the audio, so that it was like oh, nice, nice and even, and everything like that, that was that was that strategy was impossible. So you had to go by memory or rewatch literally everything all the time. I did and, that for that like one prop hunts like crazy. Yeah, back when you having a hundred episodes of something was like a crazy new idea. Yeah. Was that your first one hundred episode series, or was that Amalar? Uh, Amalar, I think Amalar was. was. Definitely. Yeah, Samlar was a long ass series, like 120 episodes. And or I something? like refuse. Yeah, uh, I think it was like 103. I I specifically like refused to do side quests after a while. I was like, this is this is because it's stupid. just a forever game, and at some point you need to cut it off. I had that experience with Shadow of Mordor and Neo, where I like at some point I'm like I'm be at some point in the second half of the game, it's just like I can't, I just can't do every side thing. It's just not. It's just so time-consuming and not worth it. It also happened in Dying Light, I think. I did everything in the first zone and like, eh, in the second zone. We did everything in the first zone and it was pretty fun, except for collecting, like, plants and shit. We Which did game? not do any of the bounty board stuff. Which game? Dying Light. Amler? Oh, Dying Light, yeah. Yeah, yeah fact, we did one quest, which was like, collect five, like, poppy seeds, and we did that and we were like, wow. Let's vote to never do those types of quests again. And it was a good call. In fact, like that kind of happened in, in, that kind of happened in both bounces. games. That, that's actually the... What felt similar about the two was that, like, Dying Light and Amalar both had the same... I mean, Dying Light and Shadow Mortar both had the same weird thing where the game was split into specifically two zones. Yes. And inevitably, yeah, if, you like do that in, if you do that in any game, the first zone's always going to be the one that got more development attention anyway. And the second one's going to be like this sort of sad, like mutant Krang hanging off the side of the game. I'm like, ah, I've got quest two. <laughs> yeah, we all we all played System Shock two, and we all lived through that nightmare. Oh god, that's not that System game's not Shock halves, two is though. like. I haven't played that game yet. Like, it's not halves. You're right. And this it's is like, the last mission. Is what? Seventy <laughs> five percent of it is good, and then it becomes horrendous. Yeah, the ending is like, what is happening right now? Ah. I'm a little stuck right now. How? Whoa. <laughs> the dragons got meaner. Every now and then they catch me, and it becomes a problem because then I'm just yeah, flying around in dragon me. mouth. Well, so I had I had one of the dragons catch me, and it didn't fly around. What happened is it ragdolled really hard. Yeah. <laughs> Except for I couldn't shoot while the dragon was ragdolling, but I was still taking damage. So it's like ah, uh, eh, eh, <laughs> uh, as we're like flying fifty feet plus away, and I'm like no. Just shoot, just pull your trigger. You have ammo, you don't even need to reload. When the I enemy's greatest, can... greatest threat is their corpses. <laughs> All right, here we go. I hope you like dragons because there's more. Oh, goody. I mean, actually, now that we're done with all the spiders being here while the dragons are here. Yeah, that does make it considerably easier. Ow. Yeah. 
I, I think I probably told you this once or before, but I remember when I first played Grand Theft Auto 3 and I got to the second island, I was like, this is bullshit, I'm not learning a new island. And then I never <laughs> played the game again. <laughs> it took me forever to learn the layout of the first island. Oh no, my I god, hitting these ever, things with the- I don't know if I ever the, did. Hitting these bad boys with the, uh, with a, with a missile in midair is hilarious because they ragdoll like crazy. Oh, yeah. The dra the dragons are so far my favorite enemy. They look kind of oh, nice. Oh, that sucks. And their ragdolls here. are amazing. I could ow, use a thick ow, ow, uh, ow, 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 ow. Everything. It's just still being eaten. I can't. Well, it's kill stuck it. getting eaten. Okay. Holy crap, it's really, like, it's busy with you right now. Yeah, will, man. Will it eventually I'm swallow kind of you deal. and you're removed from the game or something? Because, like, I kind of want to see it. No, no, I'm just saying, like, Did you just know, fly somebody, away with you? What the hell is he doing? He did just fly with me. He you flew, dick. He flew you away with your body. And he's leaving. Turbo dick. Now if I shoot you down, it'd be like, who, where's the body gonna land? <laughs> like, <laughs> this is turbo dickery. That's an ordeal into itself. It's, it's, it won't let go. Uh, I can't let go of my homing shot because I'm covered in too many dragons. No, damn it! I thought I had a clearing. Unfortunately, he's like oh, way there up we there go. too. It now barked I mean, me out of the <laughs> bottom of the hill. I mean, as long as he falls, it's fine because he's not gonna take fall damage. True. Just like. It was a it was a good ragdoll at least. So I had that going for me. Yeah. I was just I was trying to help, but I couldn't get a lock on and then actually follow through with an attack because I uh, dragons kept standing <laughs> dragons kept standing on top of me and I'm like I can't shoot missiles up at bird if I'm covered in dragons, I'll just blow up. And then then I, then I tried anyway. <laughs> ah, oh shit, you, you came sound up. like that one really annoying video on Weeple stuff. Uh oh, any of them? Yeah. <laughs> Well, no, like, ah, there was a it's like yeah, a zombie a with his, his brain leaking on the moon or something. Yeah, that oh. was a particularly annoying one. I, I it just makes exactly, that sound and it's and it loops forever. <laughs> I know exactly of uh, which one you speak. Old internet. Was I it like Alan watching Becker old Google an... stuff videos where he didn't uh, know how to loop them perfectly yet, and you could if I like you can see the loop. series. Yeah, by like series like five or six, the music and the and the video become completely desynced. Oh. The, um... Alan Becker put out a new video. He's the animation versus animation or whatever thing guy. Stick figure Animator kung fu animation. videos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh... And so he did animation versus YouTube. Just recently. And it was really uh. weird because it was like he was, do he was doing like the reunion tour through all the old, like, old viral stuff. So at first it's like, oh yeah, Charlie bit me, great. But then, then it's like, oh shit. Urban Ninja, I haven't thought about that in 10 years. <laughs> Thanks for the revival. Bye. We had Again. no health, man. We had I, no I, health. No, you're saying that because I revived him while the mission oh. victory screen was up. Yeah. <laughs> that was the first oh, chance wait. I got to have health um, and then come down to him. Um... <laughs> hey, guys. It? Oh. This is going to be There's fun. three. Yeah. Oh, so my God. Uh, I read... I, I like the line here. Our plan is to deploy numerous Balans at once and destroy them in one fierce battle. So I guess we all get a Balan this time around. They have siblings? I don't know what I should use. We'll go with... Hey, I, went, I don't know. I went back to that video, I'm like, oh right, this is why, this is why I found out about Rise Against. Uh, I don't know what's gonna do the most damage. I'm gonna do something that's like... Uh... I'm gonna do this one. And then I'm gonna do... Uh... Uh... This one. Wait, no. I don't wanna do that it's one. dumbest gun. <laughs> Let's just use shotguns. Let's do something basic here. I like my shotguns. Look at our poor baby percentage. Do you think we get closer to completion faster in this game or Fortnite? <laughs> Fortnite. This game might actually require you to do more, yeah. It's just 
I don't feel compelled to do more in this game. No, it's like, a completely absurd end. metric for completionism that makes no sense. <laughs> Holy what? shit! <laughs> That's more than three. That's way more than three. All right. Everybody pick a Balam, because I believe we wow. get to drive them. All right. I'm going to get this one. Uh, how do I, how do I, how do I use one? Oh, uh, they're alive already, I think. Oh, yeah, these are, they're these all are already moving. piloted. We don't get a Balam? Nope. No, I think we're, uh, I think this is one of those missions we've heard about where you kind of just watch. I think we're here to cheerlead, yeah. Yay! Uh, no, An no, no, army no, no, of no, no, mecha no. robots we, fighting an army of dinosaurs. We we do get them. We do get them for this mission. We just have to wait for ours to show up. These dinosaurs are eating shit right now. Yeah, all the dinosaurs getting knocked on their fat asses. These guys are way better at piloting Blams than Wander was. Hey. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> you guys, just wait until you get in one. It's gonna get, uh... I, oh my god, Ooh. the screen shake. <laughs> I am so glad I have this screen shake off. No, you need it for the hype. <laughs> I, I like the screen shake. It's really, really bad. <laughs> it's so uh, absurd. It's so overdone. It's like a bad indie game bloom. Yeah. Oh, those two dinosaurs fell over on top of wow, each other. Dude. That's how a baby dinosaur is made. <laughs> yeah, we just witnessed something. Something okay, beautiful. Yeah, that screen. It, it feels like I'm I'm watching a, a home video filmed by a child <laughs> on like a sugar high. Nah, it doesn't. It's never the home video experience fully until you get those horrible, horrible like fiddling, fiddling with the camera noises the entire time. Okay, we got bugs to go after. Camera noises are the worst thing ever. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. What does a camera noise Just, sound like? Whenever someone's bad at vlogging or bad at filming, you hear the constant like. Like in the background or whatever, like it's just like the hand on camera sound that's hard to explain. Oh, the... My favorite is when somebody covers the microphone on something. Oh, yeah, right. There's the wind, there's, there's, there's the wind getting to this microphone sound, uh, sound. There's, there's this muffled audio of somebody make putting their thumb over it, and then there's this the weird, like every time they Ow. slightly shuffle their hand, it makes horrible noises. And it's like imperceptible to them, so they don't fix it at all in the action because they can't respond to it. It's like when somebody fiddles with the microphone that somebody else is listening to live. It's like they can't know the horror they're inflicting on them. <laughs> Back in the days where uh, Bird and well, I guess all of us played Gmod. You remember how I'd like bring on new YouTubers occasionally to like kind of fill ranks uh, and someone would stick around. Yeah, yeah. There was one section neither of you guys were invited to. Yeah. Um, and I, I only remember this because it was Spider Pocket myself, and one of the guys, when I curated his his videos, they were fine. Okay, yeah. So when I when I curated his content, he had like a, a Yeti or a Snowball or something. When he plays played with people, apparently he switched to a headset because it was more comfortable. Um, uh, and so, oh. Uh, yeah, so, so he, he had, would frequently... So he had good audio in his other videos, but for his multiplayer he had terrible audio and he didn't uh -huh. think about it at all? Well, no, he thought about it, and I was like, can you switch back? And he's like, no, and I was like... Can I mean, I can't just tell him to go away. Yeah, you could. <laughs> well, yeah, eventually that's what happened. Um, he had to keep adjusting the microphone, because it was kind of one of those, like, soft mic whatever things. Oh, uh, so the adjusting was making noises too? Yeah, so it was constantly, like, oh, just... No. Boo -boo -boo -boo. As he's like shifting it around, and it was like too close to his face. People just have zero like professional self awareness. awareness in these situations. So I think it was eventually Spider, uh, being you know, god damn, I can't aim for shit with the screen shake. Like I'm constantly surprised by people who don't one. know how to conduct themselves. Like I had a friend of mine, I had a friend of mine who was an audio engineer, but like while we were recording, he wouldn't understand for some reason that he has to go to the microphone if he wants to like contribute. Ooh. Right. It's like he would be like, oh. he'd just be, he'd be like, no, I don't want to be in this one. And he'd be like doing the equivalent of like, like the jokes about like the wife that doesn't want it, that says that she doesn't want the dessert or whatever, but then keeps taking it from yours. But they're doing that for like commentary of like, they keep like, like they don't want to be in the episode, but then they keep like, like chiming in here and there from across the room. I guess Shell does that too sometimes. Yes. And it's like, no, yeah. you got to just go to the microphone. It's fine. And then my friend Max freaking just answered the phone once during a let's play. <laughs> <laughs> like, he was sitting in the middle of the couch between the two microphones, and he just answered the phone. And I'm like, what do you... Like, uh, we paused the game, hey, man, and Andrew... 
We paused the game, and Andrew and I just stared at each other and locked eyes silently, like just in shared befuddlement oh, of what was I happening. Oh, I have two of the Erotosauruses, or whatever these things are called. Like, I, I can only assume he was having so much fun with, with our Diablo 3 series that he literally forgot we were, were even doing videos. <laughs> and it was just, yeah, just man, hanging out or people something. Are, people are just very, very, very unaware sometimes. That's the thing I want to do again. Speaking of just, like, fun podcast games, like... Four-player co-op shared screen Diablo 3 is so good. Oh, yeah. Specifically, shared green is fan shared screen's fantastic because you're actually together. Because your movement speed in that game is so fast and the screen is so small that you're barely ever on the same screen as your teammates when you're norm when people are normally playing that game. Just because of oh, how man, fast this... dungeon, dungeon delving goes. But when you play it together, it's like gauntlet. This this erotic source Rex was just getting pummeled by two balams. Well, yeah, it looks like that. they're actually dying here. I wonder if you can mod that. Uh, there's that'd be, only, that'd be there's cool. Like, what? Mod what? I'm just talking about the oh, shared... Oh, they just shared, spawned a bunch more talking about the shared screen Rexes. Diablo. I don't know. It'd be neat if it was an option that you could turn on for PC. It legitimately makes the game better. Except for the part where you have to, uh... Look at your inventory screens. <laughs> So it'd be best of both worlds if you were, like, playing together by having to hang out together online, but also ha you'd be playing online so you have access to your own screens for inventory management and stuff. Oh no, there's one Balam currently fighting, like, four dinos. It's like, you you remember we had that problem when, the, when all of us got together with Shell and we played the four of us playing Path of Exile. Yes. And it's like we were barely on the screen with each other most of the time because it's just so wide open and so spread out. Oh and yeah, so, I remember that. And that, that, has, that, that also <laughs> happened in the other game we played that's not uh, Grimdon. Yep. Grimdon was a little bit better about keeping us all grouped together, but only barely. Well, it's only because the areas we had were the, much the, smaller and tighter. It, it was mostly because we had the super... We were constantly spamming portals. Through. Like that, but that shows how fast the movement speed is. Is the fact that like somebody would put a portal down, and then five seconds later, somebody would use the portal and have no idea where the person was that used that put it down in the first place because of how yep. fast you move and change locations. Yep. We've been playing Path of Exile on my own. It's actually a really fun game when you don't have to worry about like trying to get a group to function on it. Yeah, the uh, Diablo Two. You know, if you really think about it, the characters move pretty glacially. The problem, or the good thing, is that the game's resolution was so small. I mean, you cover, can move pretty slow. Yeah, you, you cover you the don't. you cover the screen's like length every two seconds, basically. Yeah, it's just like Mega Man speed. And then you sort, then you go and the teleport sorceresses, and it's like ah. Yep. Oh, well, they're gone. I just think of just teleporting sorceresses in. with C3PO map hack, so they can get to bail as fast as possible for bail runs. <laughs> Oh man, so you can get like your plus 38 magic fine d underwear. Yeah, underwear it's cause plus it's, underwearness. Because it's 2% more magic fine than your 36% magic fine underwear. This one dinosaur is not fighting anyone. <laughs> it's just overall here on the boundary of the map, just hanging out. Every now and then it seems to kind of charge at me, but not very well. Yeah, the dinosaurs. That's gonna hit me. Nope. There are we go. getting. I, I don't. I don't know about this yeah. mission. It feels weird to see the dinosaurs just get their ass. Oh, like mega this. dinosaur! Mega dinosaur! Oh Where? no! Oh, there we go. That's He's a mega dinosaur. Fast too. That's the point of this mission is that, is to show yes. EDF be finally like we can finally defeat the dinosaurs and then like mega dinosaur shows up and ruins us. Yeah, he it's is like, no. much faster too. We so did not anticipate the power of pallet swaps. <laughs> <laughs> Even Red the means dialogue. It's stronger. Yeah. Even the dialogue just said, red means it's stronger. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I didn't hear it. I haven't heard any of the dialogue in this game, honestly. It needs subtitles so bad. It, I'm, subtitles. I'm never near anybody else to hear it. Well, it's on... It, this is the radio. Like, you can, you can yeah, just hear the people directly in our ears. It, it just constantly... Oh. It's the pinnacle of evolution, you might say. I just have the game audio turned down very, very low. This guy's never gonna die. I'm just fighting a dinosaur one-on-one -on -one for a while now, and it's just not going down. 
I'm sad he never help. became our friend. <laughs> At the same time, we got Uber Mecha. No, Mecha cannot be friend. Mecha can totally be friend. No. No. Have you not seen Gundam Wing? No. Mecha was totally friend. They're not friends not... with their Gundams. Hero kept trying to self-destruct his, and his kept refusing because it would kill Hero. That just means it's programmed not to blow to kill its owner. Yeah. Nah, he would like fight with you. You have him. a very weird definition of friendship. I don't blow <laughs> you up. Better <laughs> not. These childproof scissors are alive. <laughs> childproof scissors have such a strong sense of morality. <laughs> they will hurt nary a child within 30 feet. No problem. Do it. Okay, there's our blems. Oh uh, yeah, I just saw them getting uh, helicoptered in. Wait, are they? What are the other Balans doing? Do you, like, do you, do you see this? They're just in a weird uh, circle. Oh yeah, there's a Balan pile. I think are, I think all of them might be aggroed on one thing that they're trying to fight. No, or they might just be stuck. There's a thing alive over there. So I'm, yeah, I'm single-handedly fighting the one remaining. I, I was single-handedly fighting the one remaining freaking dinosaur because they couldn't find it. <laughs> yeah. Well, there, there's there's big. Okay, now Rex. they're coming in unisorm. Uh, unisorm. <laughs> well, I just mean like I needed all those idiots to fight the one remaining normal dinosaur because I was fighting it alone. All right. And, and they were uh, the only thing that's left is a uh, Bigosaurus Rex. I better go get into the lamb. Yeah. This is gonna be like my one opportunity to use this dumbass thing. Oh, there they I are. Mean, Technically, if I bring Air Raider, I, I think I can summon them freely now. They're just... they take so long to charge up. Hey, Keith, can you go to the one of the farther away ones so I don't have to run as far? Because I might not get to it in time when the mission's <laughs> over. I'm almost at the right one, the right most okay, one. Okay, yeah, if you're Keith, facing. you can get the center and I'll, uh, I'll get the leftmost one. First. All right. Oh, oh wow. God, I'm this so big now. so weird. I don't yeah. know how to fight. That's, that's and, the punchy yeah. button. And how, how do I? That's the how other punchy punch? button. So, our, oh, I can tell you. Oh, okay. <laughs> I have different buttons oh, than you. Oh, you just got owned. Listen, I can own you if I want to. Oh. Okay, so if you start falling over, press <laughs> P, and I believe you'll get back up. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> that was funny. Holy shit, this thing is larger than the rest. It's hard to punch rock this thing without hitting em, Rock em, sock em, rock em, sock em. More fun than a pillow fight. I never played with those things, Blow but I them up, to. Put your hands inside. Get ready to have the time of your life. Oh, fuck. How do I, how do I stop? <laughs> oh. Just ate shit so P. hard. P to P? fire your thrusters and get back up faster, I believe. That's the jump button, I believe. I already fell over, so I just guess I'm gonna let the blam do its thing. Oh, I got him. I got him some solid slugs. Can we shoot with these things, or do nope. they literally just punch? Uh, later versions get guns. So that giant thing on my shoulder—that's a giant gun, isn't a gun? Yep. I'm never gonna even become. I'm never gonna get close to this dinosaur ever again with this movement speed. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this movement speed sucks. Oh yeah, if you press P, you can you can stabilize. Also. <laughs> now the whole Valam squad is here. We're just punching him in the yeah. dick over and over again. We'll, we'll never be able to maneuver around each other's hitboxes ever again. I can't yeah. even get around Wanda right now. I'm trying to walk perpendicular <laughs> to him and I can't move my character. My character will not budge. It's like Flight of the Valkyries, but more like Crawl of the... Fl Flight of the Screen the Shake. <laughs> nah. Da, 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 you think they could put at least some level of like cushioning in, in, the, in the cockpit for this thing? Yep. How am I half like, dead already? Maybe, maybe like wheels. Wheels We've would enable break. the concussion motron. <laughs> the concuss motron. Yeah. Oh, good. It's up against the, uh, it's up against oh, the... Oh, now, now, now we got it on the ropes. Now we can just yeah. pummel on it freely. This is for long six. I've taken critical damage. Not critical damage. What do we no. do? It somehow slid past me. No, I just oh, got here. No. 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 <laughs> Divas <laughs> creep lows. <laughs> it's so fast, and we're not. Uh. This is... 
stupid. Well, that's, that was the last time I'll hit him. <laughs> Isn't he just gonna turn around and shoot a laser at us? Oh no. Is that why he's glowing right now? No, he's, just, he's not he's glowing. Just... Laser glowing. He only just got slugged by one of the Balams. Yeah, Jeez. one of the Balams apparently has a gun and it just was like, pew. No, no, it We're... just uppercut him. I saw like the fist fly by. Is this what it's like to go to those conventions you guys are trying to get me to go to? There's a cool thing yeah. really far away, and you have yep. to wait for a bunch of large people to get out of the way well, for hours. Yeah, yeah. so that red thing is Austin Wintry, and yeah. uh, these are all me. No, 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 that red <laughs> thing is most definitely me. Game Grumps. <laughs> I'm getting is out this, of this fucking thing. Is this the dinosaur walk. laser party? This is... Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. Like, it says it's all slow-mo. It's like, <laughs> oh, yes. Just a scalper Einstein. He invented, he invented space. space. <laughs> Have you ever listened to really slowed down, like, 5,000% slowed down versions of, uh... Like, Justin Bieber car songs and stuff like that? I've nope. encountered some joke oh. versions of like, here's a song, it's, it's one cool. song for ten hours, but it's literally playing once over the course of ten hours instead of repeating, but I'm like... Yeah, those I, usually sound pretty neat. I look at it for like a second, I'm like, I get it, and then I move on. Yeah. Like, I'm like, I can't do this. I don't this. think anybody watches those ten hour videos, and if they do, holy shit, do they have a lot of time. Ow! I mean, if, if it's the repeat for ten hours thing, it's usually that they literally just want to have that audio in the background for a while. Of what? Two mudkips going, mud! Kip! Mud! Kip! Well, a lot of them are audio- I mean, are, Some of them are uh, just a catchy thing repeating, but some of them are definitely is, like, I'm going to annoy people in this building. <laughs> is it just me or the allied Balams just faster? You want- yeah, somebody want to get out and just like come resurrect me because... If I have to wait for you to Balam over here... Honestly, I'm just bored we'll there, with certainly. that perspective, so I'm just gonna go back to cruising around. Because it's cooler here, yeah. I can like see how radical and gargantuan the fight is, and I can go shoot missiles at the dude and stuff. Exactly. Exactly. If all the Balams hey, are just going to win for us, then I'm not going to be bored in a Balam. Ah, let's get past you. There we go. Donker. And this way I can pick up all the, get all these pickups around here. Birds, so, stop shooting at me. There's a lot of pickups. It doesn't do any damage. It does. It does. Like what, two? 2,000? You're gonna break his How? actual... How does it do 2,000 damage? You're gonna break his actual armor, and then he's gonna be stuck on foot, too. Yeah. That's fine. Well, I mean, for me, it's great, because I'm <laughs> significantly faster than the Balans. The secret is I don't care about your feelings. <laughs> oh my god, I'm going... Man, oh my god! City. Jurassic Park! I'm wow, sorry, no, he... I mean, King Kong. He's stuck in, he's stuck in the corner now, so maybe this will be faster. I just had the King Kong <laughs> remake experience. Say... This mission is really stupid. Yeah. It, it's a cool like, idea, it's a little a long for that, though. Well, I think the main issue is just ultimately the, the Balams are so much slower than the dinosaur. And, they, the and design, all, the, enemy, all the, the allied Balams are still here, so it's like, oh, well, that worked yeah. for a few seconds. But then they all get in the way. Yeah. Like, if they all were actually fairly quick, or could, like, go into, like, a roller mode, they're then essentially trying to hype up be great. without having real cutscenes. Like, look yeah. at this hype thing, but you live it instead of watch it. I'm like, that's cool. It's like, oh, but you can't play anymore because they're closer and you'll never fix that. The dinosaur shit. is so far outside of the gameplay. <laughs> like, wow. At this, this point, nuts. I'm just farming uh, armor because there's just boxes of it everywhere. At this point, he's been crowded into a corner and there's so many lamps that he stands oh. up and gets punched. There no, goes. my nice. armor. I punched him like five times, I think, and then walked menacingly towards him. <laughs> I turned around to the last second to see what was left, and it just looked like there was like an oil refinery in the distance. Just because there's so many Balams in the crowd. I, I got it. so many items I had to scroll, none of them were new. <laughs>